In keeping with our green initiative here at ServTech Solutions, we are pleased to announce that we will be taking part in a very exciting new project. Here's a little bit of information about that project. NASA joins forces with Florida Power and Light by announcing their plans to begin construction on a $78.9 million solar power project at Kennedy Space Center. Construction is expected to last around six months. The project will include 35,000 solar panels on a 60 acres northwest of State Road 3 and south of the Kennedy Space Center Visitor Complex. Surftech is doing all the site layout for the site development company, which means for site work, it's not vertical work, it's the, it's the grade work, they're changing the grade, slopes and so forth for the um, solar panel field and so forth. So they're laying, basically bringing everything to the engineered elevations and so forth. Um, so that the solar panel company can come in and then put the solar panels in. The new construction will be named the Space Coast Next Generation Solar Energy Center. The solar plant will produce approximately 10 megawatts of emissions-free electricity, enough to power about 1,100 homes. In addition, a 1 megawatt solar plant will be implemented to power the Kennedy Space Center. The separate solar plant will be contained in KSC's industrial area. According to a 30-year agreement, the Space Center will exchange land to Florida Power and Light for the larger plant for energy created at the smaller plant. There will also be a 20-year renewal if both parties so choose. The solar project is expected to create around 100 new jobs during its construction and, when completed, will reduce carbon dioxide emissions by more than 227,000 tons. Surftech Solutions will be providing the land surveying work required for this project and is very proud to be part of the team on this new energy project. Personally, I think the solar panel fields is a good idea. Anytime that we can come up with an alternative form of energy that kind of helps us get, I guess, away from foreign supplied energy, I think it's a good idea. It's an easy solution. Um, the sun supplies a huge amount of energy to the earth every day. And I think if we become more efficient at it, it may be the way of the future. Right now, I think there's debate over whether or not it's the most efficient way, but you got to start somewhere. And I'm actually very excited, excited to be on the ground floor of this, of, of the construction of one of the first solar panel fields in Florida. to be a green surveying company from the get-go and we've really put an effort forward to go paperless obviously surveys have to be output in their final format in paper most of the time but other than that on most of our records um, we've gone digital um, we recycle and we've done a lot of other green initiatives and I think this is just another way we feel like we're doing our part to um, help the green initiative help the environment and it, it's very exciting to us um, I'm actually in the process of trying to become LEED certified, take the test in a few weeks, and I, I think this, we just, as surveyors, even though we're not directly involved with the design of green technology, we we, we got to understand that we supplement it, that we can be a part of it, and I think that's where ServTech is. We feel that we're a small piece, but we are a piece of the puzzle for green technology and energy.